our convoy grows. We just picked up Mike Cowan from Clearview. Uh, we're just heading out of uh, Bullia and on the last leg to Birdsville and the Big Red Bash. We stopped on the way and had a chat to Mike. Mike, you've done a bit of travelling, I would suggest. Where have you been? What have you done? Oh, I've been everywhere. I've yeah. done, done the Tanami and been over to Broome and up the Cape and done the border tracks in Victoria, Gippsland, high towing, country. Towing vans or, or uh, you've got a trailer on the back there? But yeah, so. done a lot of towing over the years and I drove trucks years ago and, you know, when you drive heavy haulage and, yeah. you know, interstate and stuff like that, you tow, tow, tow. So. Mm -hmm. So we're heading to yeah. the uh, Big Red Bash. Any expectations at Birdsville and the, and the Big Red, the magnificent Big Red? Big Red, yeah, I've been up Big Red in my other cruiser and... How'd you go, first time? No, no, because I got a little bit cocky and I didn't let me tire pressures down low enough. Ah. But I went back down and I dropped them down and next time I come over the top making air, so... Yeah. Yeah, tire pressures make a huge difference when you're travelling in sand. Absolutely. Well, we're going yeah. to we're going to uh, go off the bitumen in a little while and and let ours down a little bit. See yeah. how the, what the road condition is like, and we'll we'll have a look. See how soft it is. Yeah. Right, um, okay. So, Clearview. How did Clearview come about? The mirrors. Uh, it was purely out of frustration. You know, we we used to do a lot of towing, and and I had a. I still got an F an F three fifty a two thousand two model, and I was towing a forty foot trailer with that, and I had a beautiful set of slide mirrors on it, and then I bought a Land Cruiser and um, hooked it up into my caravan the first time to go away and drove out the gate, and I've looked in my mirrors and I've gone. Don't oh. tell us what you said, but yeah. Yeah, I said yeah. something like, yeah. mm, "Good golly gosh." Yes, that's it. Something like that. Yeah. And um, anyway, back in the shed. Yeah going through boxes, finding these other things that hang off the side of your car and went away for a weekend. And by the time I got home, I was really frustrated with the mirrors. So I just decided it was time that somebody made something better. It just sort of grew and it's been 10 years now and we've got mirrors now that we can adapt to about 50 different models of vehicles. It's all about the quality that you put into Absolutely. it. Absolutely. Backing your product. Yeah. Value for money. We want the product to go out there and still be running around the Australian Outback for, you know, years and years to come and people going, you know, this thing is the best add-on to what I've like us, fitted mate. in my car. Like yeah. us, we want to be running around the Outback in years to come. Let's hope, let's, let's hope. hope, yeah. Cheers, so. mate.